My talents lie in combining materials, and I'll use those in my possession to craft things for you in my spare time. Heyo, you a soldier? Could be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if we've had to start sending out new recruits to call them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say... Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way? Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? The lad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fie! I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far, only a short ways out from the main gate. You've my thanks. And Ocado's as well, I'm sure. We have been called upon to render aid. Let us make haste. Goods for sale. I hasten home. Were well, this not my duty? There's no easy way of making a living as a soldier. There are you. Look, Master! Goblins! We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness! That was well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. That's thrilling. I did not know I could feel so alive.
Am I the first to notice we've all got different vocations? Our respective abilities are unique as well. Yeah, at the end of the day, our vocations are of little import. Mutual trust is what counts. Unlikely location for a path. Mayhap it leads to a hidden hoard of treasure. They keep your wits about you. We needn't go barging in. over there. We ought to take a closer look. A fantastic find. This is why I shall never tire of our adventures. We have found a material. Different combinations of materials result... ...in different creations. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. Shall we report back now?
wish me at the vanguard? By your will? was a long one, but here we are at last. Hail, friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. T'was a relief to see him return. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it. T'was a bit too early for him to be seen actual combat. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. Look, Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime.
Do come again. With any luck, the instructors in the training ground here will have a cardo bat already year long. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. If you are in need of aid, I've not the time for your prattling. Bother someone else. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No harm in picking a few. Come to think of it, different masters favor different pawns. One whom I serve preferred to have bistrons for allies. Each to their own. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. Try not to get beat. There's no way to win. Go to waste. I'll wager I could make that shot. You cut quite the hunter's figure. I have a knack for gathering items, and am ever on the hunt for new finds. I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I espy. Now there's a worthy prize. If only twan't so far away. Chest. What harm could there be in having a peek? We've a choice of where to go, but how to know the path best traveled? Ah, let us pick a path and be done with it. If our choice which is a poor one, we can simply return.
Thank you. I am in your debt. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. It's rather valuable, this. A fitting reward for a rigorous search. So this is Melv. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. Mayhap a walk through the streets would help jog your memory. When the Arisen appears, so too does the dragon. Tis an immutable truth of this world. If you're looking to buy, just say the word. Pleasure doing business with you. It takes two to make a sale, and this seller had nothing to tempt us with. Our funds are better spent elsewhere. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin.
best keep your distance. It isn't safe here. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. Goodness, how are you feeling? This is the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. You hung on and by some miracle, Survived. I'm sorry to hear that. 
Though I cannot say I am surprised. Your a great many were bathed in the dragon's flames that day. You must be special, indeed. How else could you have survived to return here? I am of the Border Watch. Someone with Arisen-like abilities came to this village torn in tow. Know you all to this? Has he come for you? We are to part so soon, then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then. Take care. Everson. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. Shall we seek some answers? some business with the apothecary, sir. Dreadful sorry if I was in... Oh, no. I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My fat... So when I had Talava medicine only to be found in this village, I thought I'd come and fetch some for us. I made the journey all by my... But, well, as luck would have it, it will be a shame to return empty-handed after coming all this way. But what... What? I suppose there's no harm, it seems my luck's not as rotten as I thought. I'll wait right here for your return, sir. We could make the fruit roberunt ourselves, or simply purchase some at Rune's Apothecary here in Melv. At last, it all becomes clear. Here for some fruit, Roberunt, are we? Between you and me, guys, they're mighty easy to make. Simple as combining the ingredients, if you know what they are. Always a pleasure. What say we see this delivered? Hello again, sir. Say, have you brought some fruit robberant for me? Oh, so I haven't much to offer in return. I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. Such moments make me proud to serve the Arisen. Well, Matt, you're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? She told me all about it. It was a very brave... I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, now tell me, are you registered with a guild? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized... Tr well, now, that won't do. You need only... Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vocations, mayhap I can advise you. Tis a vocation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. I am a fighter myself, 
and should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, I might be willing to impart unto you some of what I know. Naturally, it is a vocation for those who seek to master the bow, an exception. At close range, however, a bow is nary more useful than a walking stick. Aye, the secret to being a successful archer is maintaining distance between you. It is a vocation for those who seek to master the mystical arts. Magic. Mages can cast. However, the more powerful the spell, thus a mage is unlikely to last long on the field of battle without allies to protect. It is a vocation for those who seek to master the dagger. Such blades lack heft, though this grants them the advantage of speed. Thieves favor light armor, which leaves them more vulnerable to it. Their talents depend upon their finesse and ability to compensate for the length of their blade. Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you will find that new paths to master will open up to you over time. Try them as you like. Very well. There is no wrong choice, but I shan't take up any more. Moment long awaited. I knew it was only a matter of time before your skills reached a new height. There's no discipline that steadfast devotion cannot teach. Here at the inn, we also offer changes of OK. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? It is good to be busy. Work begets opportunity. Always a pleasure. There's a ladder here. After you, Arisen. So this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. Let us speak with everyone we can think of who might know aught of use. You really ought to have returned by now. Mayhap tis time I went looking for him. Ah, you've returned. Good timing, too. I have questions for you. First and foremost, will you accompany me to the... My thanks. Are you ready to depart, or do you need some time to prepare? Good. Then let us be on our way. It is about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? This won't last long. 
Hale, if you've a moment to spare, I'd like a word. As you can see, we're rebuilding. A task that can always benefit from... What say you? Would you be willing to help? Excellent. You're a good sort. Uh -huh. Here's what I need from you. A bask of Saurians has made their nest outside the village. Though they're yet to cause any harm, their proximity makes them... I'd like to enlist... I've prepared some explosive casks and left them by the village entrance. Use them to send the Saurians scattering. Saurians are monsters of fearsome strength, it is true, but I've yet to meet a foe that explosive casks can't scatter. I quite agree. Useful ingredients to be gathered here, or will you jump? Jump see if there's ought to be found while we're here. See if we stumble. The Dasorian territory. Fire won't do much good here. Best try a different tack. The Arisen has been drenched! Pick ourselves up, dust ourselves off, and try not to slip up again. Well, that appears to have sent some of the beasts re to finish the job, I'd have you drop a jar of poison into their nest. With any luck, the Saurians will realize that they ch But pray, take care not to drop it in the river. You must make sure your aim is true. Good. You'll find the jars of poison just outside the village. Toss one. A single jar of poison ought to send those Saurians packing. Only do be mindful not to spill any on yourself, Master.
Spurtley throne, master. I'd wager those Saurians will think twice about nesting here again. Such moments make me proud to serve the Arisen. Oi, where do you think you're going? Our destination is the border checkpoint. You've done as I asked, I see. And I must say, you've a fine arm. I couldn't... Watching you got me thinking. <laughs> or perhaps... In any event, thanks to the work you've done for us today, the rebuilding efforts ought to proceed. Never for a moment could I doubt you'd grow stronger. Huzzah! You've done it! We have achieved our objective. What will our next adventure have in store for us, all? Success. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? to do. He really ought to have returned by now. Uh-huh. There's something written here. A thorough perusal might reveal aught of interest. <sighs> Full well, glad I am to be returned to you, Master. I cannot thank you enough. Not to discuss. The other day, I espied an elf of all things. They ill favor living alongside the people of other. I understand their reluctance. They, not to mention their tongue, is a mystery to us. If you can't share a jest. Fancy look at my wares. The safer the roads, the heavier my pockets. Do come again. Well met, sir. How might I be of assistance?
One can see far to the distance from here. I'd gladly cast aside my weapon and laser about here, <laughs> if the arisen would permit it. Right you are. <laughs> 